I want to have sex with the car, respectfully, like. Oh my God. McLaren hooked up a 600 LT Spider, and I'm in love. It's zero to 60 in 2.8 seconds. Quite simply, it fucking rips. Like that first time you do heroin. Yeah. Ah, where can I get some more of it? It's right here. This is the car. Now we're inside the 600 LT. The interior feels very familiar having spent time in the 720S. One of the most hilarious things to me about this car is that it also has auto engine cutoff. So yeah, you're at a stoplight and if you don't have this button press, the engine cuts off in this, the same way it does in your Jeep or your Honda Accord. I just think it's hilarious to have a, you know, an exotic sports car like this um, that gives you the illusion that it's trying to, you know, save gas in your nearly 600 horsepower car. I lucked out in not just getting into this beautiful 600 LT, but it's the 600 LT Spider, which means the top goes down. What's up, dog? All the fun of the 600 LT and all the thrill of the wind blowing in my hair. The thing about driving in a car like this is you're kind of constantly thinking about, am I gonna get pulled over? I've been pulled over a significant number of times. I got a ticket when I was uh, 20 driving through South Carolina. I got a ticket for going nine over. Nine miles per hour over the speed limit. I thought the general rule was 10. I actually said this, there was a, a highway patrol guy there and he goes, no, the rule is, is the limit. And I was like, yeah, that's true. He's like, yeah, it says 55, so that, that's the limit. Limit's not 65 and a 55, it's 55 and a 55. I was like, I, you know what I fucking mean. So he gives me a ticket, and I guess I kind of forgot about it. I actually had a, a, an open warrant uh, out for me. I don't know if you've ever had a warrant in your name, but it was a new experience for me. Probably the most terrifying experience of my life was when I got pulled over. Um, I was about 23 in Los Angeles on Sunset Boulevard, which if you don't know, is a very uh, highly traffic busy and most especially on a Friday or Saturday night. This was that. It was a Friday night and I was, uh, I was in a rental and I'm working a job and we go out for drinks and I had like one or two and then we're gonna go to another location. Well, you know, it was probably like two or three. As I'm driving to the next location, I've had too much to drink, I shouldn't be driving, I'm in a rental, and I start driving like a dick, like fucking around on Sunset Boulevard. Dude, I get pulled over, and when I get pulled over, it hits me that I've had too much to drink. This is going to be a catastrophic moment in my life, right? I'm like, I'm going to jail. I'm so fucked. We were pulled over at like a 7-Eleven right off of Sunset. Cop gets out of the car. He asked me for my license registration. He goes, you know, you're driving kind of erratically. And I was like, yeah, this is a rental. That was my explanation for my, how I was driving. He was like, what? I go, I, I'm just learning how to use it. The cop takes my license and registration and he's like, okay, have you anything to drink? And I was like, mm-mm. Dude, I, this is like a movie. This is like a movie, what happens. As he takes my license and registration, he gets a call on his radio, like the, the radio that's hanging on his you know, shoulder. And 
I just hear the, uh, you know, the code. Blah, 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 blah. And then he responds back, and he goes, it's your lucky day, I gotta go. Hand, hands me the license, jumps in his car, lights and sirens, peels out. And I just look at my friend, and I was like, <laughs> that was it for like having a drink and then driving for me, like even a drink. This experience with the 600 LT Spider, I gotta tell you, is a, is a really, really spectacular one. And I don't know how to best summarize it other than saying that I wanna have sex with the car respectfully. Like, I'm not talking about like, being aggressive with this. I'm just saying that's how much of an endorsement after you get out of the car you're like I wonder if I could uh, make love to the car would, would it appreciate it you know which again you know you shouldn't physically do it but the thought will occur to you so this one right here which I've not made love to I've done nothing explicit or, or nude or anything uh, but this absolutely spectacular spec could be yours with the options, the racing seats, all the carbon fiber. It comes over to just a hair over $300,000, worth every penny. Um, you know, if you're like, that's expensive, you know, yeah. But I mean, you know, you could rob somebody. You can get into selling things, kidneys, get one. They're amazing. Yeah.